You and your family might eat a juicy watermelon on the 4th of July, but have you ever considered using that watermelon for an amazing science experiment? Of course I have, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. On the inside of my watermelon, I have hollowed it out. It's empty on the inside, other than a secret ingredient, which I'm not going to tell you. You can't do this experiment at home. Only a teacher can do it. I'm going to mix that secret ingredient with this one. Then a chemical reaction will happen, and we will have our 4th of July foamy watermelon. Are you ready for this? Three, two, and one. The reaction is taking place on the inside, and there it is. The reaction is taking place on the inside, and there it is. That's a whole lot of foam. Look at the red and the blue. Notice that it's giving off a lot of heat. I can feel it right here. Extremely hot. This is an exothermic reaction. Thermic means heat. Exo means outside. Pretty cool. It's an amazing experiment to watch. And that's all you can do. You can't do this one at home. For Hooked on Science, I'm Jason Lindsay.